So today, today I would be telling you about this gorgeous wig from Victoria's Wigs. This wig is so fire, like, I, I don't really have words. I just don't. Victoria's Wigs is one of my favorite hair companies of all times. They just have really great units that curl really well. The hairlines are nice. The parting space is nice. The cap construction is nice. I really, really love their wigs. And I would honestly say this is going to be my favorite wig from them so far, if it fit. So, sadly, this one's uh, a little too big for my head. I need to check the cap size, but it's too big for me. However, I still managed to get it on just fine. But that's not a bad part on the company. You can obviously get any cap size that you want. Just make sure that you get the right cap size. Like, try and measure your head at home. Other than the cap size, I can already tell y'all this is my favorite wig from them so far. Let me just give you guys the hair details. So, this is their HD Lace. HD Lace is so so undetectable and so much more realistic if you can see like you cannot see this lace the main feature of this wig is their beautiful hd lace it's like some i don't know some otherworldly junk it is so amazing so i wet my arm here's a piece of the lace that i cut off from earlier and as you can see this junk is just amazing it just melts right into your skin like so beautifully hd lace front wig pre-plugged hairline is his 300 percent density but it, it it's so flat like like i cannot believe this is 300 percent density like the hair is very full but it's not all bulky and nasty like it is so nice 13 by 4 inches of parting space so it goes all the way to your ear on both sides and then going back i got it in 26 inches and it is a straight unit it came in their very cute signature pink and white box inside the wig comes in a bag another reason why i love victoria's wigs is because their wigs become in pack y'all they got everything in there so it comes with this cute little goodie bag the bag itself is so cute i've been using a lot of them as pencil cases <laughs> the bag is super cute it comes with all kind of goodies inside combs and edge combs tweezers a brush like all kind of stuff it also comes with some wig caps inside the box the wig is in a bag which is amazing because when i travel i like to use these little bags cap construction very very nice you got a comb on the side comb on the other side a comb in the middle a big nice comb in the back and i really like that this unit did not have lace in the back because i never use it and it kind of bunches up so i like this type of style in the back instead of the lace adjustable straps and it came with a removable elastic band. Now, as I said, this unit was a bit too big for my head, so I did cut out that elastic band, and I sewed it back into the wig closer to the ear tab so that I can get the front to lay really snug, if that makes any sense. So, let's get into the styling. I had to throw this on the mannequin head just so you could see the beauty of this pre-plucked hairline. This is some of the best pre-plucking I have ever seen. Like, they did such a good job on this unit, it wasn't even funny. After that, I put it on my head and I began styling this unit. Good things that I want to mention is how flat it was. Like, I really did not have to do much work to get this to lay flat. I went in with some foaming mousse and the hot comb is always, but as you can see, it's already really flat, especially for being 300% density and a bit too big for my head.
is just dream come true wig. Like, I don't even know what to say. It's 26 inches. It's like my favorite length of all time. I did curl the ends. I put some very loose curls in at the ends. I just wanted to kind of give it a little oomph. Okay, so let me just go over some of the good and the bad points. I don't have anything bad to say about this wig other than the fact that it's too big for my head but obviously like i said you can pick the size of your wig i just gotta get the right one i don't know what it is but every time i get a wig that's like more than 22 inches like 24 inches and longer the cap sizes tend to be bigger that's what's been happening with the past like four wigs that i really really liked the Every single one of them were too big. I don't really know. Keep in mind, I have an extremely small head and so most wigs don't fit, but usually all the wigs from Victoria's Wigs usually fit me, so I think I might have gotten the wrong size. That is it. Highly, highly recommend this wig. The hairline is very impressive. It comes with some amazing HD lace. Cap construction comes with everything you will possibly need to make this a put on and go wig. This can totally be a glueless lace wig. Hair quality is very nice as well. It always curls very easily. Their hair usually curls really nicely, which is another reason why I like to get the straight units. I did not curl this one very much. It was just a little bit at the ends, as you guys saw. Victoria's, Victoria's wig, wig y'all done did it again. Y'all done did it again. I do have a coupon code. It is SL15 for $15 off of your purchase. If you do buy from them, please use my code. Highly, highly recommend. I know y'all won't be disappointed. Like their wigs are just so fire okay that is it you guys if you like this video be sure to give it a thumbs up like and subscribe so i can make more videos and yeah i will see you guys next time